Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue with Fortnite when you are trying to play the game using Steam or Epic Launcher you got an error with the name launch error 3004 couldn't start the game. So without wasting time let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. Click on the start menu type cmd run cmd as an administrator type here a command sfc space slash scan now and hit the enter key wait for this command to finish scanning and verifying the files of your system which in turn help you fix out this issue one more thing friends once this command is completed you need to proceed with the second command again open cmd in the admin mode and this time type in dism space slash online space slash cleanup minus image space slash restore health and then hit the enter key these both the commands will verify all the installation directory of your windows files which is available in c drive and if any file is corrupted it will be replaced using these simple commands so once both the commands are completed make sure to restart your pc and then relaunch the game from the epic games launcher or steam launcher if this failed to work out let's proceed with the next step go ahead and open your epic games launcher now click on the option library now next to fortnite click on this three dot icon and choose the option manage from here you will find the option of launch options go ahead and turn it on and from here type in no eac once i've done this close it and relaunch the game same thing you need to do with steam go ahead and launch steam if you are playing the game using the steam now in steam go to library right click on your game choose option properties in the general tab you will find the option of launch options go ahead and type in minus no es once you have done it close it now go ahead and relaunch the game to fix out the issue of fortnite launch error couldn't start the game with error code 3004 if this failed to work out and you have an old pc it's better to turn off the integrity to do so again you need to open the command prompt click on start menu type cmd run cmd as an administrator here one by one you need to paste these two commands these commands may not work in my system because I have turned on the secure boot of my PC. So if secure boot is unable in your system also, these commands will not work. Once paste it, hit the enter key. Now copy the second command and paste right over here. It is saying the value is protected by secure boot policy. It is because I have turned on the secure boot in my system. That's why I said if you have an older PC, these commands will definitely work but for new systems these commands will not work because secure boot is enabled by default in the new systems now if this method failed to work out let's proceed with the next step first of all head over to c drive windows folder here find system 32 folder here in the search bar type in easy anti cheat and here you will find the file easy anti cheat you need to right click on it and choose the option delete click on the continue option to provide the admin rights once it is completed close it now open epic launcher again click on this three dot icon and choose the option manage click on this folder icon to open the installation directory of the game here open fortnite games folder binaries win64 and here you will find a folder with the name easy anti cheat open it open certificate and whatever the files present over here select all of them right click and choose the option delete once deleted right in this pane you will find the option of verify files go ahead and click on the option verify this will go ahead and verify the game files and reinstall the anti cheat files that was deleted earlier by you same for the steam if you are using steam open steam library right click on your game choose the option manage and click on browse local files here also you will find a folder with the name easy anti cheat go ahead open the folder or you can directly delete the easy anti cheat folder in the steam installation directory and then click on the option verify integrity of game files and this will reinstall easy anti cheat software in your pc to fix out fortnite launch error couldn't start the game with error code 3004 once you have done these things go ahead close it restart your pc 
and once restarted relaunch the game using epic client or steam client and this will completely fix out the issue so as of now this is all about it friends if this video works out for you i request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel thank you so much friends thank you for watching